Chief Justice Gertrude Tokono is advocating the deployment of technology to strengthen the land administration system for economic development. She says poor management of land is to blame for low investment levels which are contributing or which is contributing to poverty among the citizenry. The Chief Justice was speaking at an annual general meeting and surveyors week celebration in Kumase. Now Aljima has more in this report. Land holdings remain relevant in all economic ventures, hence its importance to the national economy. To the Chief Justice, challenges with acquisition of land results in low levels of capital inflow for individuals and the country at large. Land litigation constitutes the majority of civil cases due to the weakened land administration system. The Chief Justice, in a speech read on her behalf by Justice Georgina, Mensa Dacha noted some professionals, including lawyers, have contributed to the challenges. It is therefore clear that as a nation, if we are to resolve the riddle and puzzle of the prevailing poverty, we must own up to the role poor land management has played in the low levels of investment, low levels of economic growth, and low growth of businesses. In finding solutions to the problems, she is proposing the use of modern technology despite its own challenges. The clear and present danger of a country drowning in maladministration of land can be arrested if we harness and apply technology in land administration. How smart technologies can be used to reshape land management and infrastructure development. I believe that these words have never been more pertinent than they are to our nation as land management nears a technological revolution. I speak specifically of smart technologies such as blockchain technology, digital trust interoperability, geographic information systems and the Internet of Things. Meanwhile, in improving the professionalism, the Ghana Institute of Surveyors has introduced measures to deal with quack surveyors in the system. Dawood Suleimana Mahama is president. Now the institution has uh, uh, decided to self-regulate. So because of that, what we have done is that we are giving each surveyor a stamp. So any work you do, you authenticate it with your stamp which is machine readable. You can use a QR code to determine the qualification and the validity of the existence of that surveyor so that uh, we don't have uh, people duplicating or duping people by claiming that they are surveyors. Chairman of the Lands and Forestry Committee in Parliament, Francis Menu Adabo, emphasized the need for further regulation and instruments to sanitize the system. The, the technology that is going up, you know, with this smart technology, we did not capture many of the things in the land act because the technology is moving very fast. So we have to be doing uh, instruments and then uh, regulations most often to, you know, help the land act, you know, to regulate the uh, land acquisition system and management in the country. So I implore my uh, Ghana institution of surveyors to liaise with the ministry so that they can always give us information that will improve the act which is already in the system. The institute inducted new members at the annual general meeting. For Joy News, Nanaya Ojima, Kumasi.